I'm uh, heading back to the car. I got some stuff to show you when I get there. Hi. Well, we're back to the car. I have to get my waders off. The process of getting my waders off used to be a pain in the rear. It's much better now. What we're trying to do here is give you tips to make you dangerous. So waders are wet, boots are wet and dirty, and I have to sit down and take the waders off and get everything dirty and wet and it was kind of a hassle. But now I do it differently. I have this tool here. That is a Sims waiter bag. It's called a taco bag because it looks like a taco. And venting. So when you put wet stuff in there, it doesn't get moldy. Of course, we will hang them up when we get home. I don't let them sit there wet. I don't like that. Right side out for a day or overnight and let the outside dry and then flip them inside out and let the inside dry. If I'm waiting, if I'm on a trip or something and I'm going to be waiting several days in a row, I'll turn them inside out and let the inside dry, make sure that the side that's against me is dry. The outside's going to get wet again the next day anyway, so I don't so much worry about that. But when I get home today, I'm not going to wade right away again tomorrow, so I'll hang them right side out, get the wet part dry, and then flip them out and let, them, let the inside dry. They are breathable. They will dry inside, but much quicker if I hang them up and, and flip them inside out. Anyway, there's been waiter bags on the market before. This taco bag is a little unique because this taco bag, you'll notice the zipper goes all the way from one corner to the next. And what that permits me to do is open that up into a big circle. You can see the inside of that's kind of dirty. Well, the inside of my car would be pretty dirty if I didn't have that. Anyway, you can see that opens into a circle. I've got a pair of slip-on shoes there. When I go out in my waders, I always bring a pair of slip-on shoes because I don't want to have to deal with tying and untying shoes when I'm slipping in and out of my waders, especially if we're moving spots a lot. My feet are dirty. I'm standing on the ground. A lot of times it's gravel in a parking lot, you know, in Arkansas or Wisconsin or Wyoming and I don't want to stand with my stocking foot waders in a bunch of garbage So the boots are dirty. I don't want to put them in my car Waders are wet. I don't want to sit on my seat. You'll notice I'm gonna unclip that roll that up That's a gator the concept behind that is It keeps stuff from going inside my boot undo both of those Now I'm standing with my stocking foot right on the waiter bag so I don't have to worry about getting a bunch of gravel and garbage on my waiter boot. My other waiter boot. I'm going to undo my belt, unclip, unclip my waiter, suspenders, unclip the other side. I never put my socks down on the dirt. I never put my wet waders down on the dirt. I never put anything wet inside my shoe. My boots and my waders are in the waiter bag. And I'm ready to throw them in the trunk and go home. I think those things retail like $39.99. That's just a superior system for taking care of your waders, keeping all of your gear dry, the inside of your vehicle clean. We'll have another video on Friday. Hope you enjoyed.